Hey, how you doing everybody? This is John and another video. Uh, I'm gonna finish up the series. Uh, first of all, I have the review and the manual for this unit. And now I'm doing the battery and setup for the sharp projection alarm with eight sleep soothing sounds. Okay, so pretty much basically there's really not a, this unit is really easy to set up. It's not really very difficult. Okay, so if you decided to go ahead and buy this unit after um, after you watch my review or if you bought it without even seeing the review okay so it's really easy um, this unit requires two uh, AAA batteries as a backup uh, in case the power goes up it does want you to plug it in okay so pretty much basically you'll just plug it in on your uh, either your desktop or uh, on your nightstand okay so uh, first of all, uh, when you plug it in, okay, I've already had it already set up already, but I'll go through it again. So what you do is you are going to press the time button, okay? And you will hold it in, okay? And you will go to the plus, and you will set it at six, AM and you will hit time to set it and then you will go again to the plus sign to hit the minute Four and time to hit enter and that's it it was a quick setup it wasn't really anything really too difficult now if you're wondering how do I set up the projection well there's really no way that you can set up the projection um, unfortunately with this model um, you can't really uh, do anything if you I will show you in one second let me go ahead and shut the light off I'll show you what the projection looks like up on the ceiling okay so you have the dark mode you press it and then you will see the dark which is 654 on the ceiling now the projection only lasts for about five seconds okay so it doesn't really stay on all night okay also if you see well it's kind of upside down well again with this unit you can't adjust this thing over here okay it's pretty much basically stuck in one section. All right. So you're uh, kind of limited on this thing. You know, it's not really, uh, like I said in my review, I only rated it up as a six. So it's not really uh, a very, um, I would say, high speed model. Okay. It's pretty much very basic. Okay. Also, if you're looking at the sounds, okay. Um, the eight soothing sounds that they give you, okay? Okay. Eight is pretty much basically the highest level it will go to. If you want to scroll through the different sounds, you press the button of sounds again, and it goes to rainforest. Press it again, it goes to pan. I don't know why you wouldn't want to hear a fan all night. Campfire. The rain. The ocean. The babbling brook. The white noise. And the thunderstorm. If you want to lower the volume, you press the minus sign. And it goes down. Okay. And that's pretty much basically about it. And then once it goes down through and it returns to normal time. Setting the alarm is pretty much basically the same thing. You press the alarm button and then you go to either the plus or the minus setting the time. Okay. And you've got two times to where you have two alarms to set for. It's not an AM FM clock so you can't worry about whether finding the radio stations or the alarm button. And again with the projection you cannot set the light. You know, so if you lay down and saying, well, it's in reverse, <coughs> excuse me, 
um, you, you can't adjust it, there's no focus, and there's no button to turn it around. So if you take a look at the manual that comes along with it, it really doesn't pretty much basically uh, tell you how to do it. So, and I tried multiple ways to find a focus button, and there is none. So there you go. You have the Sharp Projection Alarm Clock with eight soothing sleep sounds. So uh, again, I told you I rated up as a six. Uh, I wouldn't buy this unit. I just uh, checked this out. I was uh, a little disappointed, I'm looking for something a little bit more. So, but if you did buy it and you do like it because of the sounds, um, well, that's good. All right, then. You guys have a great day. I hope you enjoyed this quick video, and uh, I'll see you next time. Bye.